Oh, I'm not gonna call you a Discord kitten. Everyone tells me I'm the cutest kitten on the server. One million dollars now or a hundred dollars every minute I don't speak? Hey, my boyfriend broke up with me. Are you kidding me? You're not even gonna say anything we were dating for two years. Do you even care? Oh, 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 oh. Hey, babe, uh, what's wrong with her? Please stop making that face right now. Are you mad at me? Why won't you talk? Then can you say something? Are you giving me a thumbs down right now? Fine, if you're not gonna tell me why you're mad, then I'll just go. <gasps> Excuse me. I'm done. We're breaking up. Ugh, whatever. Bailey, can you please read paragraph five out loud? You can't say no, I called on you. Do it now or you're gonna be suspended. That's it, you're suspended. Ew, what is on your face? What, what do you mean? Look at yourself. What is that? Your hand must have slipped while you did eyeliner. I didn't do it. Why would I mess with my nose contour like this? Okay, guys, let's not fight. Your soulmate probably did. What, did they draw on me in my sleep? No, whatever your soulmate draws on themselves shows up on you, too. And done. Dude, why would you do that? It looks so bad. It was already bad. Hey, Bailey, nice butt chin. What? I do not have a butt chin. You literally have a butt drawn on your chin. Oh, this means war. Let's see how they like that. You spelled regrets wrong. I did. Bailey, what is on your face? Go to the office now. But I didn't even do it. Oh, don't worry. Your counterpart's in the office already. Okay, I'll go. Next. Oh, hi. Could I have a- Let me take a guess. You want the number three again? Yes? How did you know that? You come in here every day and get the same thing. I'm a woman of habit. You should really branch out and try something new. Number four is great. You know what? Fine. I'll take number four instead. I didn't catch your name. I didn't get yours either. It's Jake. Nice to meet you, Jake. Miss, your order is ready. Oh, I haven't even ordered yet. It's you again. I already made you a number three. Maybe I was gonna order something else today. You weren't though, were you? You don't even know my name, so what did you put on the bag? I put Jane Doe. That's what you do for someone you don't know. Hey, Mom, I got your food again. You got me the number three, right? I didn't like that number four. Yes, of course I got your favorite. Have you been seeing any of the news channels? <sighs> About what? There's a killer on the loose in our town. He's a handsome young man who calls his victims Jane Doe. I heard that he's dangerous, so stay away from handsome young men. Okay, I won't talk to any handsome, suspicious men. Okay, great. Your total today is 549. I only have a five. I'm sorry, that's not enough. I can pay for it for you. Hey, wait, you're the guy from the cafe. And you're the mysterious Jane Doe who won't tell me your name. Yeah, that's me. I can't let you buy this for me. It's overpriced anyway. Come on, it's not that big of a deal. It's only $5. I got you. Thanks. Are you, like, stalking me or something? What? No. Why, why would you say that? How did you find me here? It's a small town. There's only so many places to go. I gotta get going. Wait, what's up? Do you want to hang out sometime? I would love to hang out. Are you, uh, free tonight? I'm free tonight, too. That sounds great. Awesome. I'll pick you up at 7. Okay, but if all of us stop paying taxes, they can't arrest everyone, right? No, that's not how that works. So my controls my hands. What does that even mean? Ow! Oh, no, I don't like this. Sis, could you hold this for one sec? Sure. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, no. Why would you throw that? It had Grandma's ashes in it. I am so sorry. Yeah, tell that to Grandma. I was on the floor now. Oh, excuse me. Class, who would like to present first? Bailey, great. Go ahead. Great. My project is about... Uh, what are you doing? Are you feeling okay? I wish I knew. Seriously, what? Did you just dab? <laughs> Ew. Oh my god, that was the worst thing I've ever done. If you don't present, you'll get a zero in the project. What's happening? Uh-oh. But oh, you just punched me in the face. It wasn't me. You're still holding your hands up like you're gonna fight me. You can't take a dog out of somebody's yard. He probably has an owner. <laughs> He's so fluffy, I couldn't resist. Oh no, not this again. Could I borrow that pink top you have? Meow. The fuck? Meow. You have the humor of a preschooler. You know, I'm less English. You were just speaking English to me. Puro ir baño. I have never heard you speak Spanish before. Bailey, do you want to hang later? Howdy, y'all. Would y'all like to sip my moonshine? Uh, what? Let's go down to the creek and do some fishing. You know what? Never mind. Please don't hang out with us. Seriously, what's wrong with you? Ow, 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 ow. Are you, like, possessed or something? No! Okay, somebody get this bitch a muzzle. I can be adopted by a billionaire or a baker. Hey, what does billionaire mean? It must be someone who has, like, a billion friends. Wow, okay. Oh, my. Why have they given me a clearance, child? And what are you wearing? I don't know. 
Go put this on this instant. This seems fancy. Yes, well, it's better than the Walmart clothes you're wearing. Much better. And this is our butler, Gerald, who'll take care of whatever you want. Do you have to get me anything I ask for? Yes, miss, that's right. Can I have an electric guitar? Yes, I will get on that right now. Here you go, one electric guitar. Sweet, thank you. Oh, what do you do for a job? Uh, I run a very big business. What kind of business? This is not bonding time. You don't need to know. I will not answer any personal questions about myself. Now go sit down for dinner. The private chef has made a five-course meal. For dinner tonight, we're having escargot. Isn't that like the bottom of a plane? Oh my, no, that's cargo. Escargot is snails. Snails? I don't want to eat snails. Then you may have some caviar instead. What's caviar? Well, it's fish eggs. Do you guys have, like, chicken tenders? No, of course we do not have chicken tenders. Bro, you're seriously eating a snail right now. Good for you, Slay. We're going to need a tutor to fix your grammar immediately. What's wrong with how I talk? You sound like you have three brain cells total. Tomorrow you will be starting at a private school. Cool. At my old school, one of the teachers got arrested for money laundering. Okay, let's not repeat that again. It's a school for the rich and talented. Every person there is gifted. I am neither of those things. This will be your uniform. There's a uniform? Of course there's a uniform. It's a private school. I'm gonna look like a dork. That's great. I hope so. You look so much better. You look silly. Well, that's because you didn't button it up all the way. See, isn't that great? This is worse. Now, now, we have to get going. Class, this is our new student, Bailey. Hey, guys. Hey, isn't your father crazy, Mr. Carlson? Mm -hmm. I don't know. He seems pretty nice to me. Do you know what he does for work? He won't tell me anything about his job. Yeah, because he does super illegal things. My father gave me Wagyu when I asked for escargot. Can anyone trade? Mm, no, I can't. How about you, new girl? I have a Lunchable for lunch. Anyway, have you been down into your basement yet? A basement? Yeah, dude, everyone is always talking about what he keeps down there. No, I didn't even know that we had one. You need to go down there and tell us about all the crazy things. Like what? I'm assuming you had a great first day of school. It was fine, I guess. Have you made any worthy friends? You could say that. Can I ask you something? Of course, as long as it's not about my job. Well... No, you are not allowed to know any information about my job. I cannot tell you. Why can't I know? You're my dad. It's hard to explain, but it's none of your business, okay? You are forbidden from asking me any more questions about my job. Fine, I got it. I have to find out where that basement is. I checked every door in here and none of them lead to a basement. Did that bookshelf just move? No way, this is a secret entrance to the basement? I mean, he's still in his room. What the hell is all this? What are you doing down here? Uh, it's forbidden. I was looking for a bathroom. Oh, wait, Annie sounds kind of cute. I could go with that. So what name did you get? Oh, it says Annie Erection. Bailey, are you serious? I think you need to read that one more time. What? What do you mean? Do you hear what you're saying? Annie Erection. Oh! <gasps> oh! Decline! Oh my god, I can't believe I almost accepted that! You need to figure out how to read, apparently. Whatever. Remember, you can only decline two times. I know, but the next one has to be better than that. Yeah, you better hope so. Ben. I mean, that's usually a boy's name, but I could go by Ben. What is it this time? Ben Dover. Girl, you have got to be kidding me, right? Not again. Oh, hey, Amanda. Yeah, that's not my name anymore. It's Taylor Swift now. That's the name you got? Yeah, isn't it awesome? What did you get? You don't want to know. Please be good. PP time. I don't want to be called PP. Sis, please tell me there's another way to change my name. There is, but you're not going to like it. Tell me how to change my name. I can't be called PP Time forever. The only way that you can change your name now is to go and steal one from someone else. What? I'm not doing that. I knew you would say that. What happens if I just hit the decline button again? No, no, you cannot do that. Why not? Because your name will be completely randomized. It might be better. Or it could be like way worse. Fine, how do I steal a name? All you need to do is slap someone in the face and their name transfers over to you. Hey, Taylor. Oh, hey, girl. What's going on? Dude, why did you just slap me? You said that would work. Okay, I was just kidding. I didn't know you were really going to do it. Mm. Sorry, I think your only choice is just to hit the climb. Okay. Please. Mike Hunt. Whoa, I'm sorry. What did you just say? Mike Hunt. That's what it says. Do you hear yourself? Mike Hunt. I can't even say that with a straight face. You should have took pee, pee time. I know that now. There has to be someone I can talk to to fix this. Try going to their headquarters here. 
Hi, I'm. Take a ticket and wait in the line. Your number will be called. Okay. Number 69, Mike Hunt. Please don't call me that. So, what seems to be the problem? All of the names that I got were prank names. That's odd. Was it every name you got? That is definitely not right. We'll fix it for you. Really? Amazing. According to our database, someone hacked into your name system. Why would someone do that? To block you from getting your true identity. Have you met your family before? I live with them? No, I mean like your birth family. I'm sorry to tell you this, but I think you were kidnapped as a kid. What? What are you talking about? Well, you look exactly like Queen Meredith did when she was young. Okay, and a lot of people look alike. It's uncanny, but the whole family died in a car accident. Princess Sophia is still alive. Yes, but I believe that you are her. No, the system already gave that name away to the girl who it belonged to. That's what I'm trying to tell you. It didn't belong to her. It belongs to you, and that's why they blocked it. What? But why would you want to steal my identity? To uncover the fortune of the royal family. How much money are we talking about? Seven billion dollars. We have to stop them, right? Today we want you to go home and do not say anything. Why would I do that? Because we're gonna come take care of it. Hey, sweetheart, I'm so sorry about the terrible name you got. It's fine, I can just make a nickname. FBI, open up! Quick, grab Sophia, we need to get out of here right now. $20 to me or my mom. I don't really need it right now, so maybe she can use it. Hey, that bracelet is so cute. When did you get it? Oh, I used the $20 that I got this morning to go and buy it. What did you get? I gave my 20 to my mom, so nothing. That's cute or whatever, but I needed this bracelet. Do you see how cute it is? A new car, what? Well, if I give it to my mom, she'll probably just give me her old one, so... Dude, there is no way you gave that one to your mom, too. I'm gonna get a G-Wagon for my car. <sighs> Wait, why aren't you taking any of them for yourself? I don't know, I'm happy with what I have, so it's fine. Okay, you are insane if you give this one to your mom too. Well, I'm probably still gonna live with her anyway, so it's our house. You have fun with that? I'm gonna go live in a mansion, okay? I just know you're gonna regret that. Ooh, I could get a mansion on the beach. Um, did you just get another one too? Um, no, I only got the three questions before. I think I just got $10 million. Um, what? What do you mean? It just says plus $10 million. Dude, what? You are so lucky. You have to give me some of that. You can have some. I can't keep it all, but I have to tell my mom. Why do you give everything to your mom? You should keep it for yourself instead. Maybe I want to, okay? I love her. I want some of the money too. Yeah, you better give me some for lunch. Me too. Um, I have to go. Honey, I'm sorry, but there's leftovers in the fridge for dinner. I didn't have enough money for a new meal tonight. You don't need to worry about it anymore. Why? What are you talking about? Check the bank account. How many zeros is that? Ten million dollars? Where did you get all of this from? Thank you so much. This is going to change our lives. I love you. You guys need to give me all of the money right now. Whoa, hang on a second. You need to transfer all ten million dollars into my account by the end of the day or else. Save my mom or save all the money. You have to keep all the money, sweetheart. It'll change your life. No, mom, I can't do that to you. At least I would die knowing that you'll stay happy. I'm sorry, we can find money another way. No way, you actually just gave me all of the money. See you later, suckers. I can't believe you just did that for me. I love you. Of course, I love you. We need to find some other way to make money. I'll get a second job, it'll be fine. I'll be happy with anything, as long as it's with you. Me too. Bailey, I heard a rumor that you actually lost all the money. Yeah, it's true. I bet you're so jealous now that you have nothing. I have such a nice car and a house. Whatever. You are just so dumb. I would have saved all the money over my mom. You know what? Even if I did have the money, I wouldn't have given any of it to you. Why? What? You said that you would. You're just kind of a bitch. Um, excuse me?